Welcome to the Delta Math Solution tutorial. Here we have simple proportions. Here you are asked to solve for x given this proportion. To solve a, any proportion, we have to cross multiply. The act of cross multiplying is when these two multiply together, that's a cross. So four times nine is going to be the first one. Then the second one is going to be 3 times x. 3 times x. So 4 times 9, which is going to be 36, which is going to be equal to 3x. To solve for x, you have to now divide by 3 to both sides. On the right-hand side, this cancels, leaving you with just an x. 36 divided by 3 gets you now 12. So you can say 12 is equal to x. Let's enter 12 here. And that is correct. Cross multiplying, then we divide by that coefficient in front of x. That gets us our solution. Let's do a couple more problems. Here you're given the same instruction to solve for x, and you're given this proportion. Yes, there is a negative, but nothing changes about the steps in which we solve the problem. We're still going to cross multiply. So 9 is going to be multiplied across with the 10. So 9 is going to be multiplied to the 10, which is going to be equal to the x is going to be multiplied to the negative 3. So x times negative 3. The negative has to be somewhere, and I only brought up the negative with the 3. 9 times 10 gets you 90, and that's going to be equal to negative 3x. To solve for x, we divide it by negative 3, which is the coefficient in front. So divide negative 3 to both sides. 90 divided by negative 3 gets you negative 20, I believe. Let's just double check that. No, negative 30 equals to just x. Let's check our work. Negative 30, submit. There you go. So remember that negative has to go somewhere. I normally keep it on top of the fraction. So I have it as negative three. The 10 here is still positive. All right, let's do one more problem here. Same directions to solve for x. We're given this proportion. So the 2 thirds is equal to 22 divided by x. To solve, we are going to now cross multiply. So you have 2 times x. That's your first cross. So 2 times x. It's going to be equal to. 3 times 22, which is the other cross. What do you get in response? 2 times x gets you 2x equals 2. 3 times 22 gets you 66. Divide by 2 to both sides. You now get x is equal to 33. Okay. Good. Let's check our work. Thirty-three, submit and there you go we got it correct okay so there you go that is how you do simple proportions 